In today's Madden 21 video, we are going to be talking about our full Atlanta Falcons offensive uh, free guide, and we are going to be showing you guys a gameplay that I have. We're going to be doing a little live commentary here for you, uh, breaking down the principles of the guide, how to run this in a real live online match. Uh, and so we're just going to start out with bunch sale, uh, Atlanta sale. You're going to see I'm going to stay in the bunch largely for the majority of the first uh, possession here. Uh, here he's going to go ahead and press coverage. So we're going to go to clear out SE out. What I like to do with Russell Gage here is put him on that nice little um, route to the right. And we see Julio Jones uh, going to go over top here, going to try to click on, swerve catch, but didn't end up doing that. What I should have done on that is I should have motion, uh, motioned out the uh, the right side of the screen wide receiver. If he presses coverage again, you'll see I'm going to go to do just that. Uh, he's going to press coverage. So here I got the running back on the option route as a check down. And the post route over the middle against zone. Solid read to start out with two for three. Uh, what we're going to do right now, I just want to test. Just want to test his uh, quick pitch defense. This is one of those situations where I'll run this, you know, just go to this out of a no huddle situation just to see what he does, just to see how he defends it. How does he do against it? Um, there he was able to do that just fine. So now we're going to go back to Atlanta Sale. And looks like he's going to go man to man. So we're going to throw that nice little post route to Julio Jones right over the middle. And looks like he's going to go back to man to man. We're going to try to catch him here. We're going to go to clear out SE out, see if we can't get that uh, cover two man. And we do on the right side. And. He does a good job using him back on it. It's going to get that interception. That's where I did a poor job right there of reading uh, and reacting to what his user was going to do. And on defense, we're running our defensive ebook. So if you guys like the defense, you can pick up the defensive guide. Um, it is in the description of this video. It's the Madden 21 Competitive Bundle Guide. Um, and that will be updated tonight, I believe, with the 3-4 bear and with the 4-6 bear uh, packages that we'll be running too. So, and it looks like we're going to run some pistol. So what we'll have to do is go down to the uh, run defense. There you see, and that's the run defense right there. If you guys struggle stopping the run, this run defense will lock things up. Actually doesn't do too bad against the pass either. As I say that, I get burned over the top. Mm. Falcons, I gotta check my corners. Make sure that we don't have Marquise Brown being covered by somebody with 86 speeds. We're gonna do that right now. When you run man coverage, one of the kit one of the kickers is when you face someone like uh, the Ravens and they've got this 97 speed guy being covered by my guy with 88 speed. As you saw right there, we get burned. So make sure you have your fastest corners in at the cornerback position and you should be fine. Probably should have left that safety over top. I should have known he was going to go to that streak right out of there. That's fine. Gives us more offense. But guys, if you don't know, uh, my name is Cody, and what I do here on YouTube is I post four videos a day on YouTube that is designed to try to give you tangible tips, strategies, uh, just things that you can uh, take away with that are going to help you really take your Madden game, I believe, to the next level. And uh, one of the ways we do that is through these full schemes. Well, we've been talking on our channel all week long about the Atlanta Falcons offensive playbook. I've given you... Um, I think five, my five sets for success from this playbook and what we're doing right now is we're just showing gameplay with that and showing how it really works in the, in the real game. Now, sometimes with new offensive playbooks, you miss reads. You'll see that I struggle a little bit with the reads. As I, as you saw in the first one, I missed a wide open, uh, missed, missed a couple wide open reads on that. And so, you know, that's part of learning a new scheme, right? You need to run relentless repetition. You need to run that multiple times to get understanding of, you know, what exactly you're going to be doing. So, uh, but anyways, guys, uh, if you have not already, go ahead and click that subscribe button down at the bottom right. And there's a little bell icon uh, to the right of the subscribe button that's going to have you turn on notifications. That's going to allow you to get access to our next offensive scheme. Again, we're going to have, uh, you guys can catch the archive of this offensive scheme over at the YouTube channel. But you can also get um, our next up of the scheme. And here you see, if he if he continues to run man to man, we can run wide receiver cross on him all day. 
all day long. But we also stream every single night. Uh, I will be streaming tonight at 10 o'clock Eastern time. I've uh, been out of town for about a couple weeks now. Uh, and so it's been a little bit more challenging to stream. But we will be back in action tonight at 10 o'clock Eastern time. Getting everything back up and going. And I should have possession caught that. But you're seeing like... At this point, what you're going to see is we're going to start to really be able to work the ball down the field with this wide receiver cross play. I believe this wide receiver cross play is probably the best play in Madden right now, at least one of the best plays. You see that cross right just absolutely torches man to man. We'll go to bunch sale here. Julio. Over the middle, making plays happen, making things happen. No huddle. Going to go to Bunch Trail. I like this post route to Julio a little, a slant, a little bit more slanted in. Gets a little bit more to the back corner of the end zone. We're able to get in there for that nice reservation for six. And we also have that ace wing flex that we can run down in the red zone. Of course, I miss a kick because... If it's a Madden video by me, why would you not miss kicks? I'm going to have a video coming out soon about how to make field goal kicks because I struggle with the kick meter this year. All right, so on defense, um, you know, I think we played fine. I think we just can't can't give up that one play, one play touchdown. Cover three match. There we go. Yeah, we almost had him in the backfield there. That's fine. There's the slants. This pistol full house scheme is not too shabby. Setting up our nickel 55 defense. A lot of people are running nickel 55, but I don't think a lot of people are running nickel 335 the way that I run nickel 55. That's just my personal opinion. I've had some comments and some players tell me that that's actually the case. Ah, bad user. Bad user. One of the other reasons I love Nickel 55 is because you can get your safeties in here. right there and somehow he throws it completely through three people that's just awesome there's the pressure and that's why that nickel 55 like you can send some pretty sick pressure out of it in my opinion how's that not an interception How's that non-interception? I'm right there. Inside zone give. All right, Deion Jones. We're done with you. There's that nickel three three five run D. That's run defense out of a pass defense. Thank you. There's Keanu Neal. And we'll go ahead and just go down here. Of course we fumble the ball. 
That's the new dive mechanic that is absolutely one of the worst possible things they can put in the game. Um, you double tap square to dive, and if you don't double tap it fast enough, you fumble like I just did. There's the run defense. Nickel 335 normal run defense, not nickel 335 wide, even though when it really chips come down to it, you know, I still like the nickel 335 wide. But if he keeps running the ball, we're going to be able to hang. This 335 normal, the way we run it, getting the linebackers in the gaps, does really, really well against the run. See what we can do here. I'm third and seven, so we can get off the field. There's the pressure. Nickel, three, three, five, normal heat. Max protection, I think, is what he wants. And you can still do all the coverage concepts from nickel three, three, five. It's just. Now you have decent pressure. Now you have deep. You have a gap pressure. You have left edge pressure to mix in with that. We basically just gift wrapped him three points here. All right. Back to the shotgun bunch sale. Got a minute thirty, so this is where you really want to manage the clock a little bit here. Uh, we're going to go ahead and flip this clear up play. I think he's in cover two man. So if he is, um, Julio Jones should burn it to the top. Goes to cover two. That was a bad read by me. That was a bad read by me. <coughs> One strike. Left himself vulnerable to the overtop street to Russell Gage. Let's go. Out of a no hustle situation, clear out SE out. Ah, oh, just missed that touchdown. That was a tight, tight window right there. Gonna go to verticals here, see if we can't catch this over the top here. Ah. I don't know what that was. That cover six invert is a little bit weird. A little bit weird looking. That might be his. That just might be his defense over there. Like to go to our zone beater. We're going to go to my best play. I talked about this being one of the best concepts in the game, but this is curl flat. Todd Gurley over the middle. Touchdown. Let's go. It's a good drive. Critical play there. I go to my favorite. I mean, that's my, that's my most secure passing play. I think if you're looking for a concept that is just that good, uh, curl flats this year is really, really tough. Jump back into the nickel 335 here, see what we can do.
There's that egg, uh, Pete. There we go. There we go. Get that pick. Let's go. Ah, let me get that. The click on this year is a little bit slower, but... Wow, what a catch. Wow. Should have been an interception. Uh, he's max protected, so we're gonna. Should be max pro. Good, good route. Good route. Good play. Good play. Gets himself in field goal range. I'll tell you what. And watch him. He's gonna run the ball, run the clock out, and kick three. There we go. Let's go. Way to go, Neiman. For me, there's one call here. I mean, you got to go to either wide receiver cross or clear out. I think he's going to run two men under, so Calvin Ridley might be roasting him. Let's see what we get here. Yep. Throw that in the bucket. Click on. Close, but no cigar. Close, but no cigar. That's a really bad interception to throw. Can we get him down? There, we were just trying to chuck one up. Should have thrown one to Julio. We had Julio one on one over top, though. All right, first half done. Second half coming in. Now, if you guys haven't already, make sure to join my Discord. Discord is basically um, it's a community. It's a community. It's where my community does a lot of chatting in the chat. We talk bad and we. Uh, answer each other's questions. We share ideas. We've got a lot of people sharing their schemes there too, which has been really cool. So, if you haven't already, do, be sure to jump in our Discord. Uh, a link to do that is in the description of this video. That's some really good people in there. Really good people in there too. All right, he's going to go to under center. Good run. Good run there. We weren't quite ready for that. Power eye. Is the power eye this powerful? There we go. Let it go. AJ Terrell. Way to go, buddy. We'll get you another possession here with the offense. You can see it. That's what the defense does, man. That's what the defense does. I feel really good on defense this year, just so you, everyone knows. All right. Go clear out SC out, see if we can't catch him. We got the ball on the wide side of the field here this time. Just check it down to the hitch. Just check it down to the hitch. Don't do anything crazy. Shouldn't be running this play. That didn't work. That didn't work. Let's just get rid of the ball. That was a bad call. That was a bad call. Should not have called that play. All right. Let's see here. He's running. Let's go to gun tight flex RC across the situation. He's probably going to press man coverage. Ah, 
that's a really, really good route to user catch, I'll tell you that much. Saves our bacon right there. I don't know what just happened. Line receiver cross. You've got to make sure to motion Calvin really out. If you don't motion Calvin really out, it's not it's not worth it. Todd Gurley, I need you to make that catch for me. Wide receiver cross. Russell Gage on a little quick quick uh, drag, quick cross. Able to get a grand total of nothing. We'll clear out SEL with as much cover two man as he's running. Julio Jones, you've got to be better than that, bro. It's like, why do they pay you all that money, Julio? Wide receiver cross. We're going to take Julio Jones and put him on a slant. Because I think he's going man to man. And that's an absolute dot. I don't know how that corner makes that play on that ball. Oh, I shouldn't have rat caught it. I should have or rat caught it. I should have possession caught it. Dag on it. Trying to do a little bit too much there. This cat can't be man. Keanu Neal. Keanu Neal. Come on, man. Lock up, man. Run defense. I'm telling you. No QB sneak for you. I'm telling you, man, we lock up with this 4-6-D. See if he takes a tie. Or if we do it again. Oh, he got me. Good call. I shut down a spread. Mm. Good call. Good call. I was not expecting fullback dive. I don't know why I wasn't. I just thought we had blown up the dive so much that he wouldn't have gone back to it. Good read. Good run. Oh, we got out of our defense that would have stopped that. Shoot. I was trying to overplay the the power O for some reason. Because I thought the power was what he got the best push with, but shoot. Oh well. Offense has to lock in. No more mistakes on offense. Zacchaeus. A wee little man. Shotgun bunch. ATL sale. There it is. Cover two beater Julio Jones. Reservation four six. Clear out. S E out for a dot. Let's go. Let's 
what we needed right there. All right, defense has got to lock up. I feel really good on defense, though. Might release that run run defense, that goal line defense on the channel. It's definitely in the guide, so it will definitely be in the guide. Even though we weren't able to fully stop him, you saw the power of it. Nickel 335. There's the A-gap pressure. Quick to the back there. Oh, come on, Sheffield, come on. down on the ball, man. Ah. Uh -huh. Cut out. We're in the same situation we were just in. Let's see if the D can hold. Ah, okay, he's going to go to that. So we need to go. Good call. That wasn't a bad defense. Good call. Good call. Oh, I should have come out before six. Dang it. Thought he was going to try to pass. There we go. There's ATL cell. There you see it. That little C route. That's why the flat is so important. It pulls down all the zones. ATL scene. From verticals right there to the running back. A little quick, a little quick in. A wide receiver cross. There you see that route beats man to man just to prove that that route does work. Let's see if he runs cover two here. That's why those little rat catch those routes. We're gonna go down into our um, under center wing stack. And I'll show you the belly week. Touch down, nice. Good drive, good drive right there. You get to see a lot of the bunch. Got to see us click over to the wide receiver cross. Such a quick audible too from Gun Bunch. It makes them, you can really run those in combination with one another. Wide receiver cross this year is just really, really good passing concept against man to man. All 
right, let's see if the defense can lock up here. Two minutes, 35 seconds. Got an offensive shootout here. Gun spread flex. There we go. Big interception. We can go close the game out right here. All right, you got to believe he's going to go man to man because he's frustrated, mad. So we're going wide receiver cross. Get that guy out there wide. Good defense. Good defense there. Those are really, 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 really underneath zone. And this is where you've got to mix in, and I have not done a good job of this, but you've got to mix in your um, your zone beaters. Right? He's been running a lot of zone. A lot of those underneath cover two, which leaves these seams wide open to Russell Gage. That underneath cover two, if you throw the seam, quick seam pass. Single back bunch. We're gonna go to HB slash. Oh, almost got out of there. That cut back to the left side was wide open. This is where you go down into your single back. Um, your single back uh, set here. wide zone here there's that big wide zone that's why I love wide zone in this year's game I'm gonna try to get this quick pitch out here well see how they pull didn't quite get the blocking one belly weak Mm. And now it's going to be right into the HP slam. Oh. All right, fourth down. We'll take a timeout. We're going to come out. Ah, shoot. We're going to take a delay game. We're in a completely terrible play call. Unless we can get into our single back bunch from this. Uh, Single back bunch, HB, quick pitch. Do you do that or do you go wide trail? That's the question. We're on quick pitch, quick pitch and see what happens. Bust it to the outside. Todd Gurley not able to get in. That's okay. That's all right. Should have D up here. Angle route. AJ Terrell. Ball game. See this quick toss. A little quick pitch to the right here. Got to run it like toss. Let it glide, let it glide, and then make a cut. We'll show you slot cross from this. Ooh, man commit on me. 
That's why I really like under. play here. We're going to go under again. And we drop it. Of course we do. Blood flow prevent. Should have thrown that a little bit earlier. Again, you know, part of the offense, you do have to understand um, whenever you're running a new offense, you do have, it does take a little bit of time to understand, you know, exactly how everything works. So um, that was ultimately, you know, part of the challenge with some of the, some of the plays we got stopped on. But hopefully you saw in this video the potential for this offense to really be able to uh, destroy. So anyways, guys, I want to thank you for watching this, guys. We will be live tonight. I know I haven't streamed in a couple days, but we will be live tonight at 10 o'clock Eastern. I've uh, been traveling across the country again, but uh, we are back home now. So we'll be live tonight at 10 o'clock Eastern time. So make sure you subscribe to the channel so that you can see that. Also, if you haven't already, make sure you jump in the Discord um, so you can also uh, just chat in the chat, get to know people. Thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you later.